Get up, get out, get around, and do it, do it! <laughs> What's going on, guys? How's everyone doing today? I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. I'm gonna go out for a little bike ride today. I'm gonna go to the oldest part of our area, which is the downtown area. You've seen me ride it a dozen times. But we're going to do it a little different today. I'm going to try for the very first time and use two cameras. That's right, two cameras. I don't know how much I'm going to enjoy this. Using one camera is bad enough. And on top of that, uh, instead of having a full covering over my, over, uh, my main camera here, I just put a little bit of that uh, fuzzy little fuzzy material that I that I normally use over the mic I don't think it's gonna do very well because the little double-sided sticky tape I have is kind of thick and it keeps it out a little bit so it's probably not gonna do real well but we're gonna see how well it does anyway so let's hit the road and see what we do today mm. So I got the Dragon Touch down there. I got my whatever the word this is camera here. So interesting. dual camera thing is kind of weird it's like for it to really work you'd have to run both cameras at the same time and be able to overlay picture in picture and all that and kind of see both points of view so that's where it's kind of difficult Just getting out of the sun for a minute, stopping in at the old courthouse. Anyway. Okay. Dragon Touch is a finicky little camera. I never use it. Honestly, it's probably the third time I've used it. And I've had it since Christmas. Uh, just not a great camera. 
I'm finding that I'm probably not even recording as much footage as I think I am. Because whenever you push the record button, it doesn't record. You gotta like push it again or something. I don't know. It's really iffy. Really wishy-washy and we'll see how it goes. Not only that, it might be better if I switched the cameras around. Because this camera here has the better quality. And I could get more of the stable footage, you know, from my chesty. And use the cheaper one just to do quick little, you know, shots of me and looking around. So, I don't know. It's nothing I'm probably going to do uh, very often at all. It's just something that crossed my mind today and I thought, well, I'll try it. But this will probably be one of the few times you'll see me doing it just too much to mess around with when you're trying to ride you know but uh, I was just trying to do something a little new a little different um, like I've stated before in my videos really videoing my normal everyday rides is not that appealing and fun to me but I do it because I think most people started my you know subscribing to me because they seen I was cycling so I try to throw a video out there once in a while you know every so often uh, even if it's the same stuff over and over it's what I do I mean that's just part of it I don't really go anywhere I'm just here in my town so uh, you know it is what it is I try to give you a little something anyway so I think I'm well rested enough I'm probably only about five miles in my ride so I got at least oh six seven eight more miles before I will call it done so let's get a little bit more time in on the road shall we Hey, how you doing? So I just kind of put them two ladies up past uh, cycling just a minute ago. And one, uh, I think I've cycled with both of them, but the one I know for certain, uh, uh, she's the lady that I did the, my uh, century with back in like early March of 2017. So it was nice to see her. She's still riding. Uh, she's pushing 70. So. She still looks good, still out there doing her thing, and the other lady probably every bit her same age. So they're doing some pretty hefty rides today. That's really great. Cycling truly is one of those sports that you can do pretty much forever. Uh, and if you end up having balance issues, then they have the recumbent bikes or the the, the trikes and stuff like that. So. Uh, Cycling is really one of those things you can do forever. I've cycled with a with with uh, people that are in their 80s, and they kill it. So.
so I've only rode with people a handful of times and uh, mostly uh, probably three or four of those times was with those older folk and man they kill it it's crazy This hill here is no joke, guys. I'm in my granny. 42 in the back. Alright guys, <coughs> I'm up here at Grove School now, boy that road is steep, the little road is called Flower, Whew. and it's a steep little booger, plus coming up the parking lot here climbs even farther, so Whew. that'll wear you out. Anyway guys, this is about all the video I'm going to do until I get maybe closer to home or home to sign off. Working these two cameras is driving me crazy. So, I might get a quick little video of me going down the hill here. Something. We'll see you guys. I almost hit you? You think so? She is. Where's she at? She's in bed. Oh. Huh? I see. She's at work.
right guys I'm home if this video turns out at all with mixing these two video cameras together these two action cameras if I can do anything out of that at all I hope you appreciate it I hope you give me a thumbs up a like a share all that good stuff a comment a pat on the back even if you will Ooh, I got in about 15 miles something like that if I remember correctly I'll put a map anyway guys get up get out get rad do it to it and be a boss uh, that was cheesy when you're doing it we'll see y'all later Get up, get out, get ran, and do it, do it!